ladies and welcome back it's your girl marquita with marquita lv luxury on today we are going to speak on the denim collection again i am going to provide some prices along again with the product code numbers but before we get started make sure you view my past videos like share and subscribe tell a friend how much fun we have over here don't forget to visit your girl on instagram at marquita lv luxury now that we have it out the way, you guys know exactly what to do. Go grab some wine or some tea and a light snack. Hurry back so we can get started. Only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Only gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Okay, besties, I am going to get straight into it. This absolutely broke my heart, but I told you when I woke up in the morning and my CA sent me prices, I went nuts. I was like, this is, this is insane. This is crazy. Okay, so here is the Sunset handbag. This is a handbag, honestly, that I was interested in, and I'm still looking at this handbag. I really do. It's just something about it. I just adore it. I don't know. This is a sunset again, product code number M46829, and this is $3,100. For this size handbag, that's absolutely insane. But again, I have been wanting this denim line from, you know, any handbag from the denim collection from Louis Vuitton for a while now. I was even considering purchasing a vintage handbag, and I'm still looking at the vintage handbags as well. I just don't like how the Vachetta look on some of the vintage handbags that I've actually seen. So again, this is a Sunset handbag. This is coming in at $3,100. Again, guys, this is without tax. So if you are interested in any of these handbags, make sure you at least have $300 to $400 for tax put to the side. And if you don't, you don't need to be purchasing the handbag anyway. Okay? The next is the Papillon. The Papillon. Am I getting it right? Let's, let, let, me, let me do it again. The... Papillon, the Papillon, the Papillon, that's it, I'm not trying to get, the Papillon handbag, I knew this was going to be expensive as well due to the smaller handbag that's attached and also the gold hardware, they most definitely set us up with this one, and I also saw a vintage piece, a small denim vintage piece on Fashion File, and the price was insane as well, but this is $3,450, guys. I'm telling you, this is almost reaching the $4,000 mark. They are really trying to get there with these handbags. I'm telling you, just pay attention. Product code number M46830. This is the Papillon, the Papillon handbag. I love it. I'm going to get that. The Papillon handbag, but also remember, they added the gold stud hardware on the Vachetta. So we are paying for that as well. And that gold strap that's on that smaller handbag. $3,450. Next is the backpack. I knew this was going to be expensive as well, but I thought it would almost reach that $4,000 mark, meaning I thought it would be at least like $3,800, $3,850. Let me not talk too much before they change the price. But this price is the same as the handbag that I just showed you, the Papillon handbag. This is $3,450. Product code number M46. Eight three six. This is crazy. I told you when my CA sent over, she was just like, Marquita, we all knew. So for a CA to say, hey, we were expecting this, that mean guys, I honestly believe it's going to get worse. It's going to get worse for it. So here is the backpack. Oh man, I am a backpack lover. I really am, but not as far as the denim goes. Okay, I, I love my canvas backpacks but for you can for you backpack lovers that was interested in purchasing let me know if you'll be purchasing this for three thousand four hundred and fifty dollars the next i think this shocked everybody in the lv community the denim high rise bum bag whoo two thousand nine hundred and seventy dollars 
So they took off the $30, you know, just to mark it right under the $3,000 mark. So they let us keep $30, but then we still have to pay tax. So it's over $3,000 anyway, LV. Product code number M46837. Here is the high rise bum bag from the denim collection. Of course, it comes with a adjustable good tar strap. It comes with that denim bag tag that doesn't make any sense being on the front like that. It should just be that Vachetta piece that's matching it. They could have added anything, but this denim piece, and it's too large for the handbag. I will honestly take that off. And attach it like i said to a pair of my jeans or another handbag here it is two thousand nine hundred and seventy dollars again keep in mind this has the gold stud hardware all around the vachetta you know that's protecting the zipper so we are going to pay for that i keep telling you guys that because that's very very important lv could have most definitely left that off but i do think it adds to the handbag to the bum bag and it's very cute the next, a lot of you guys wanted this as well. The Crucent, the Crucent, the Crucent, because someone corrected me on this one too. The Crucent MM handbag. I also thought this was adorable as well. This is also coming out in monogram. Okay, the monogram canvas. Here it is, this beauty here. And it also has the little minis to match. You guys know how I feel about minis, but that mini added on to this price. Again, $3,450. LV. Come on now. But again, this is an MM size. So that's that's a good thing. If you are interested, please contact your CAs. The product code number is M46856. They are really, really giving it to us. And the last thing that I want to speak on, guys, is the key pouch. It seems that everyone is going to have key pouches on because it's only $500. So I guess everyone is going to be walking around with a key pouch. Well, let me be exact. It's $505. So everyone is going to have a denim key pouch. We are going to find a way to convert it into a crossbody because these prices are honestly in say so let me know uh, what you have your eye on my ca also said that it's more to this collection i am supposed to receive those on wednesday along with the prices so i am going to look out for those i think it's supposed to be a speedy and also an on-the-go tote as well and it's also more slgs that's coming out in the denim collection so i will give you guys an update as of right now i am going to be honest with you i am still looking at the sunset handbag only because I want this denim. I want this from LV. I have been waiting for years, guys. I told you I went ahead and just purchased the denim Speedy 25 Bandolier. It wasn't the denim, you know, the denim that I wanted. I want that vintage look. So this is what I've been waiting on. I just don't want to pay this price. Like I said, if you know another website to where I can shop vintage, I just want the Vachetta to be in a good condition or an excellent condition because on Fashion File, they state that everything is in good condition, excellent condition. And when I look at the pictures, I don't see that, you know, and how I rate my handbags, I look at every, everything and the Vachetta looks absolutely beat up and I'm, I'm expecting that from any vintage handbag but you do have some collectors that really really take good care of their pieces so if you know anywhere or know someone that's selling um you know a, a denim handbag from the from lv and it's a vintage piece i am at this point willing to check it out <laughs> check it out that's it check it out until i'm satisfied with it and then i will move forward as far as purchasing but if it's any markings any pen stains of that nature I, i'm honestly going to pass i want my items to be in very very good condition even if they are vintage okay so again reach out to me let me know or if you are selling one let me know but make sure it's in great condition excellent condition because i will not purchase i am now going to show you the monogram handbag okay I am done with monogram and Vachetta. 
I, I don't want to discourage anyone, but I just have too many handbags. But I wanted to share this as well and give you guys an option if you don't purchase the denim handbag. And if you are just a monogram canvas lover, this is an option as well. I want the small handbag. I want the little mini that's attached to this handbag. That's all I want. I wish they would honestly sell it separately, but I'm pretty sure it'll probably be like $1,000. But here it is. Very cute. I love everything about it because I love a monogram and Vachetta, but I am, I'm, I'm going to pass. The product code number is M46828. Shout out to info.lv for sending clear pictures. Here it is, guys. Textile material inside. It does have a side pocket. I don't know. It just seemed like we're purchasing the same handbags over and over again. They just change it up just a little bit. But to me, when I first saw it, I was just like, okay, this giving us, you know, another option. If we don't want to, you know, purchase the denim because, it's, you know, it's almost $4,000. But then again, we don't have a price for this either. I am very curious to see. And I want to compare the denim and the monogram canvas to see how LV is setting this all up, okay? I am real, real curious, okay? So we don't have a price for this, but I am going to go back, if we go back to the denim, the Crucent handbag, the price, okay, $3,450. Let's keep that in mind, because once we get this monogram canvas price, I wanna compare, because I wanna see what LV is doing. Because if this handbag is close to $3,000, and if it's not under $3,000, they are really playing with us. A canvas handbag, we are done. We are done. I I'm over it, okay? So guys, so far, that's what I have for the denim pieces. And again, if you know of anyone selling a vintage piece from the denim collection from LV, please make sure it's in great condition because I will not purchase. So we are waiting on the Speedy, the on-the-go tote from this collection, and I will provide that this week, okay? I so I also wanna speak on this. My DMs are absolutely flooded. I try to get to them as fast as I as I can. And then, um, you know, I have my assistant check as well. So many people are sending me updates and they are returning the Atlantis handbag, okay? The Atlantis BB in reverse monogram, they are saying that the canvas is absolutely hard. And we all knew, guys, you said it as well. Some of you was like, oh, it looks like a sack you know, a paper bag, a sag bag, whatever you guys are saying. But a lot of people, they are comparing their handbags and their collection to the Atlantis BB when they receive it. And they are saying that the canvas is extremely hard. They can't do anything with the handbag. It's like a structured handbag, but it's just canvas and it doesn't move. It's hard to put things in. It's hard to take things out. If you are having issues with the Atlantis handbag, and if you return the Atlantis handbag, Please let me know in the comments because as of right now, I haven't heard anything good. I heard good about the Atlantis GM in monogram. But as far as the reverse monogram, I've heard nothing but, but bad. And I want to know, are you guys having the same issues minus the canvas being extra hard? What else are you experiencing or what did you experience and why did you send the handbag back? When I tell you it's about 12 in my DM that are stating they are not happy with the Atlantis BB in reverse monogram. And you guys know that is something that I had my eyes on. The only reason I did not purchase is because of the size and honestly the price for that size. If it was an MM or a GM in reverse monogram, you guys know that was an exclusive release. If we would have, you know, got was able to get our hands on it in reverse monogram in the GM size, I would have paid that $3,000 price. But with the BB being that price and you guys are complaining and sending the handbag back, I want to know in detail what 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 is the real issue. And if you did keep the Atlantis BB in reverse monogram, let me know. How are you enjoying it? Is it something that you are giving 30 days? Because you know you have 30 days, you know, to have the handbag. Well, I would actually say 29. On that day 30, you should have your mind made up and you should be able to say hey i'm going to keep it or i am going to the store to return it so if you did keep it and if you are still trying to figure out if this is a handbag that you want to keep 
let me know in the comments because like I said, I've been receiving all bad news and I kind of want some good news because I love reverse monogram. So thank you guys so much for everything. I really appreciate the support with my channel and I also appreciate you guys just giving me just you know love on my reorganizing my closet and thank you guys so much for being nice to the reigning king mr chris and you know him seeing the loop de loop disrespecting my handbags and calling the damier bean you know the bean just thank you guys for loving him okay as always guys stay safe stay blessed until the next video and please let me know if you are ordering still anything from the dinner collection have a great day guys Bye bye